name is uh, Robert Bagando, and I'm sitting on Battlefield Vegas FV432 British APC. We've actually made it good by mounting a US-made 20 millimeter Vulcan on it and a, another US-made mini Vulcan in 308 on it. This is one of the very few of the working 20 millimeter Vulcans in civilian hands, and it is a sight to behold. This is the 20 millimeter. This is electric firing. This particular gun is a really, really hot round. We're firing 1,500 grain projectiles, upwards of about 3,300 feet per second. So it's a ripper downrange. Traditionally, when they first built the Vulcans, they put them on F-18s, F-16s, almost all of our fighting aircraft. And the reason they had such a high cycle rate, they would only be on target for fractions of a second. So if you're only gonna be on target for a tenth of a second, you have to be able to get at least two to three rounds on target. The only way of doing that is by obscene rates of fire. I would guess the price of this Vulcan to be somewhere between fifty dollars and $100,000. The issue becomes feeding it. It is a, a very difficult gun to feed, and because of those difficulties, it actually brings value down a little bit, but it is still really rare and just one of the meanest guns out there. Whoa!